Hello ladies and gents, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a three-dimensional cone using Onshape. So to do that, create a document. When you've done that and you're looking at your different overlapping planes, simply go to the top left hand side of the screen and click on the sketch button. Once you've clicked that, you'll get a message saying select a sketch plane, choose one of the planes. I'm going to use the front plane, so if you just hover the mouse cursor near the edge of that plane so it's highlighted in yellow, and then click it to select that, that plane. Uh, and then you can draw your sketch on there. So I'm going to click on the front plane in the, um, the view cube in the top right hand side of the screen. And I'm going to go again to the top left. I'm going to go to the rectangle tool and I will click on center point rectangle. I'll go to the center point of the plane itself, click, drag, and I'm going to just draw um, a rectangle. Now it can be any size that you want, uh, it just needs to be a rectangle. So click to apply that and then we're going to cut this in half. So to do that, go to the line tool and draw a line from one corner to the other corner of your rectangle. You need to join those two anchor points up. Now if you look at the scissors in the top toolbar, this is the trim tool. This basically allows us to delete different parts. So if you click that to select it, so you can see now it's highlighted in blue. I can hover the mouse cursor over the lines that I want to delete. So I want to delete this part and I want to delete this part. So just give them a click and that little dot, if, you, if that remains, click that as well and get rid of that. So now I've just got a triangle. So that's the sketch complete, the 2D part. So click on the green check mark, and now we're going to go to this button. So in the other uh, cube and cylinder um, examples, we use the extrude button, but what we're going to do here is use revolve. So it's right next to the extrude button. It looks like a half-eaten donut. Click revolve, and it will say faces and sketch regions to revolve. I'm going to just click on the 2D triangle. That's what I want to revolve. And now we've got this red bit here, revolve axis. So this is what do you want it to revolve around? So click that red box once, and then choose the side that you want the shape to revolve around. I want it to revolve around this long side here, this bit that you see highlighted in yellow. Click that once, and you can see that the shape wraps around that axis. Um, so if I just rotate this a little bit, you can see I've got a cone here, right? There we go. It's, it's wrapped around that. So you can see the 2D shape in there because it's slightly transparent. And it's just rotated around that, that central pole, if you will. Um, so when you've done that, click on the green check mark. And there we go. We've got a cone. Very simple.